Module 3.9, PDF Accessibility Troubleshooting, Tables of Contents, Part 2. Restoring Table of Contents Items. Internal Hyperlinks. For a table of contents to be fully accessible, it should not only be tagged and legible to assistive technology, but also function as a navigation tool. Each table of contents item needs an internal hyperlink that navigates the reader to the corresponding destination in the document and is announced by an object reference tag arranged in the tag tree. To ensure all table of contents items have hyperlinks. 1. Navigate to the content panel, expand the table of contents page, and open the annotation section. A link annotation element will have been created for each automatically created internal hyperlink. 2. Select the first table of contents link in the annotations list and note the corresponding outlined table of contents item in the document viewing window. Continue with each link annotation to locate any unlinked table of contents items. If links are found to be missing or broken in the TOC, this could either be the result of a flawed PDF conversion tool or a removed section of the document. Regardless of the cause, the link must be restored with its object reference tag appropriately tagged in the tags tree. Broken links should be removed or reassigned to the correct page view destination with the Edit PDF tool. For table of contents item links that are created from scratch, their clickable link annotation will need to be manually redrawn. To generate an internal hyperlink for a table of contents item. 1. Open the Edit PDF tool. In the top Edit PDF toolbar, Open the link drop-down menu and select add slash edit web or document link. 2. In the document viewing window, use the crosshair tool to draw the link annotation rectangle around the table of contents item. Ensure that all elements of the table of contents item, the label, title, dot leader, and page number, are enclosed in the drawn rectangle. 3. After creating the link annotation, the create link window will appear. In the Link Appearance section, set the link type to Invisible Rectangle. Set the link action to Go to a Page View. Select Next. 4. With the Create Go to View window open, scroll to the location of the section or chapter that the table of contents is referring to. For large documents, enter the page number of the section. 5. With the relevant section or chapter visibly oriented at the top of the document viewing window and the page magnification set to 100%, Select Set Link. The Table of Contents item link is now restored and usable. To make a new link accessible, it must be now assigned an object reference tag. Object Reference Tags In the event that, during the PDF conversion process, a link is present for a Table of Contents item, but the object reference tag is missing, the user will have to recreate the OBGR tag for the existing link. To create an object reference tag for the Table of Contents item, 1. Open the Tags panel and locate the TOCI tag corresponding to the missing Object Reference or OBGR tag. Select the TOCI tag. 2. Navigate to the Content panel. Expand the page where the Table of Contents are located and expand the Annotations section. Select each link in the Annotations list until the link corresponding to the missing OBGR tag is highlighted in the Document Viewing window. 3. Reopen the Tags panel and open the Tags drop-down menu. Select Create Tag from Selection. The created OBJR tag should appear and be nested within the TOCI tag. Place the OBJR into the proper tag structure. The object reference tag is now restored for the table of contents item, allowing assistive technology to recognize the item as a selectable internal hyperlink. Conclusion in this module, we've learned how to restore the internal hyperlinks and object reference tags for table of contents items. In the next module, we'll look at the guidelines and processes for maintaining the accessibility of contracts and similar documents.